everyone. It's Katherine Kimmins from Laugh Yourself Healthy. I'm here today. It is October 24th and I'm so looking forward to doing these Halloween exercises with you. It's not just Halloween this month, it's also the beginning of the fall weather and of course Thanksgiving. So what I would like to do is I'd like to share some exercise with you for our Laugh Along series with Katherine. So the first exercise I'd like to start with is the following of the leaves, the beautiful leaves that fall. And what I want you to do, if you remember, you're going to be raising your arms up over your heads and you're going to be breathing in, your, in through your nose very, very deeply as if it's running away. And then you're going to bring your arms down to a nice breath out. So we're just going to do a basic yoga breath start. And then we're going to get into waving our hands like the leaves do when they fall from the trees. So just follow along with me. This is an interactive um, exercise. Follow along with me. We're going to start on three. Here we go. One, two, three. So raise your arms. Breathe it in. And breathe it out. Ah. And keep eye contact with me. Breathe it in. Now wave your arms, breathing it out. Ah. And again, breathe it in. And breathe it out nice and long, waving your arms. Ah. Now again, breathe in, breathe in through your nose. Pretend it's a wavy day and you're moving back and forth, breathing it in. Ah. And then watch the leaves fall from the trees with a giggle out. <laughs> very good, very good, yay! Very good, very good, yay! Very good, very good, yay! It's so wonderful to be back. I did have a little bit of a hiatus, but I wanted to get these exercises done for Halloween because so many people ask me, what are some of the exercises that you do at your club? And so the next exercise I'd like to do with you is called Tom Thumb. It's a breathing exercise. It helps us with our eyesight. And so what I want you to do is I want you to bring one thumb up. And as, I, as you hold your thumb in front of your eyes, you're going to move your thumb sideways, left to right, as you're breathing in and you're only watching your thumb with your eyes. I've been doing exercises for my eyes for the past seven years since I've been doing laughter yoga and my eyesight has improved. Not a lot, but there is a significant improvement. So again, thumb in front, you're gonna watch your thumb with your, uh, with your eyes only. You're not gonna move your head left and then back to right as you're breathing in and as you're breathing out. Just follow along with me. Here we go. One, two, three. Breathe it in, looking with your eyes only. And then back. Don't forget to breathe it in. And breathe it out, bringing it back to center. Ah, breathe it in. Back to center. Ah, and breathe it in and back to center. Don't forget to smile. And then let's do it one more time. Breathe it in. To center, ah. Then over to the right, breathe it in. Hold it, and then bring it back, ah. Now I want you to raise your thumb over your head, watching your thumb just with your eyes, breathing it in. Bring your thumb down, keep your head still, just move your eyes downwards, breathing it out, ah. and back up, breathing it in, and then breathing it out to center, ah. now we're going to bring it close to our nose as if you're going to touch your nose, so breathe it in, ah. blink a couple times, and breathe it in. And breathe it out. Ah. One more time, breathing it in. Ah. And blink two times. Now we're going to take our finger up to the ceiling. Watch it, breathe it in. And bring it down again. As low as your belly button, breathe it out. Ah, and breathe it into center, blink two times, 
and bring it back up above your head, watching it with just your eyes, and back to center. And you can put your hand down and shake it all about. Ha 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 ha. And now we're going to take our other thumb and we're going to do the same thing. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to watch our thumb just with our eyes. We're going to move our hand left to right as we breathe in to the left. We breathe out to the right. We'll do this three times. So breathe it in. Smile. Watch it just with your eyes. Keep your head still. Ah. Uh, to the left or to the right, breathe it in. Uh, we bring it to the side as far as your eyes can see it, breathe it in. Uh, and back to the right, breathe it in. Uh, now bring it up to your nose, watch it with your eyes only, breathe it in. Breathe it out. Uh, Breathe it in, breathe it out, ah, now take it up to the ceiling, breathe it in, down to your belly button, breathe it out, ah, breathe your thumb up above your head, breathe it in, breathe it back down to your belly button, breathing it out, ah, and back to center, breathe it out. Or breathe it in <laughs> or laugh <laughs> and put your hand down and wiggle giggle so that's called Tom thumb breathing exercise now next exercise we're going to do is carving pumpkins carving jack-o-lanterns so this is a fun exercise where we're using our imagination we're being creative it's a step-by-step -step process you know what happens when you buy a pumpkin the largest pumpkin that you can carry you bring it on home you put it, well, if it's that big, I'm not putting it on the kitchen table. I might as well just put it on the floor and start carving it. Now, the first thing we need to do when we, before we start carving our tonkin is to clean the innards out. The idea of doing these different parts of carving a pumpkin is to giggle and to laugh. And so what we need to do is we need to get a knife, an imaginary knife. And what we're going to do is we're going to start by, where do we start first? We start with the top. So we're going to carve a circle so that we can pull that top out and clean the innards out. So it goes like this. <laughs> now see if it can pull out. See if you pull carved it enough. Oh, oh, oh. I think we need to carve it again. So let's carve it again. <laughs> <laughs> pull on that stem cart, pull it out and go, oh, oh, and put it down. <laughs> now that we've got the top off, we can get into that pumpkin and start cleaning the gizzards out. What we're going to do is we're going to put, put aside the pumpkin seeds so we can bake them later. So here we go. Let's pull out all of the insides. Here we go. <laughs> Oh, dig in there. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> and now pull the seeds away from the pumpkin. Okay, because you're going to use the pumpkin to make pumpkin lattes or pumpkin loaf bread. So we're just moving the seeds away, spreading the seeds. <laughs> All right, so now that is done, we're going to take the seeds and we're going to put them on a pie plate. We're going to cook them as we're carving the pumpkin. So this is a two-step two process. So what we're going to do is we're going to take all the pumpkin seeds and put them on a tray. So this could be your tray, your other hand. So put the pumpkins, spread them out, <laughs> or the seeds. <laughs> put some more on there, spread it out. <laughs> now let's drizzle a little oil on them. Oh, <laughs> put some spices, the kinds of spices that you like to spice it up, Himalayan salt. It's really, really good, okay? And now we're going to put them in the oven. So take two hands and put them in the oven. Oh, of course you have to close the door. Ha, ha, ha. And turn the oven on. Ah. Now we're going to go back to carving our pumpkin and go back to those pumpkin seeds and take them out of the oven and smell them and then eat them. So now what do we do? When we carve a pumpkin, we've got the top off. Now we're going to carve the 
eyes. So you can make any shape you want. You can use circles, squares, triangles, diamonds. If you want to make them a different shape that I haven't already mentioned, please do so. But again, we have our knife. So we have our knife and we're going to carve. I'm going to use circles for my pumpkin. And here I go. <laughs> Take your knife, poke it into the, the piece that you've just carved, pull it out, oh, and put it down. <laughs> now we're going to carve the other pumpkin eye with the other hand. And here we go. <laughs> <laughs> now poke the knife into the pumpkin eye, pull it out, and ah -ha, throw it away. <laughs> now we're going to carve the nose. So let's carve the nose next. Once again, you can make it any shape you want. I like diamonds. So I'm going to carve my nose as a diamond. So here we go as a diamond. Let's go hee 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 this time like witches. Here we go hee 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 hee. And again hee 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 hee. Now take your knife, poke it in, and pull it out and throw it down. Ha ha ha. Now what comes next? The mouth. So let's carve the mouth. I like a nice jagged, scary mouth. So what you can do is you can make a happy face or you can do the jagged mouth. Whatever you prefer. This is your customized pumpkin jack-o'-lantern. So here we go. Get your knife. Start carving. Ah, ha, 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 Take your knife, poke it into the mouth, pull it out, oh, 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 and throw it down. You didn't get the other half of the mouth yet, so poke that knife in and pull the rest of the mouth out. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Fantastic job. So we have the face of the pumpkin. Some people mention the ears. So what we're going to do is we're going to carve one ear and then the other, ear, uh, other ear. And I'm going to use ho, ho, ho this time instead of ha, ha, ha. When you use different sounds of laughter, you're massaging all the muscles in your face. There are 43 muscles in your face, so you want to massage them all. So let's carve those ears. Ha 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 Pull it out and throw it away. Ha <laughs> ha. The other ear. <laughs> Poke the knife in, pull it out, and ha ha ha. Now what's next? The light. So let's put our little light into the pumpkin. Ha ha ha. Light the la the the la the candle, Shh. and put the lid back on. Ah ha ha ha! Turn off the light and look at your pumpkin. Oh, ah ha! <laughs> Great job, everybody! Very good. finish off by pulling our pumpkin seeds out of the oven, taking some nice deep breaths in. So open the door, ha <laughs> ha turn the oven off, pull out the pan, put it on the counter, and now take a nice deep breath in. Oh, and again, another breath in, raise your arms up, breathe it in. Bring your arms down in front of you. Ah, and let's do one more, arms up, breathe it in. Ah, uh, we can finish off by eating some of those pumpkin seeds. That are, those are a few Halloween exercises. I'm going to put some more on in a little while. Please enjoy. Please, again, follow along with me. This is Catherine Kimmins. Happy Halloween. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next video. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Bye for now. Ha <laughs> ha.